There's a new report out on what needs to be done to ensure Indigenous people are involved in clean energy projects in Canada. It was written by an Indigenous council that advises the federal government on climate policies. The CBC's Mahnoor Mubarak has more. The Waila Tooth Council is made up of First Nation, Inuit and Métis leaders who have an expertise in clean energy. The report is called Kinship and Prosperity, Proven Solutions for a Clean Energy Landscape. It has key recommendations in it. Alex Cook is a member of the council. One of the recommendations is to make it easier for Indigenous groups to access federal funding, which Cook says will be helpful. I think that if we can do that, we can advance uh, economic reconciliation, we can lift Indigenous communities out of poverty, we can respect Indigenous knowledge. Kim Scott is another member of the council. She says that it offers a voice for Indigenous people. Clean energy is important, but shifting the way we make decisions in Canada and including the importance and contemporary relevance of Indigenous culture in setting direction for Canada is key. The report will help inform policy and legislation for Canada's climate change strategy. Manu Mubarak, CBC News, Iqaluit.